The McNair program uh, was uh, founded um, and named after Ronald E. McNair and its initiative to get underrepresented students like myself into um, complete PhD programs and then diversify the academic field. It's a program that, that, that helped us undergrad to achieve higher education, to obtain a PhD. I meet with Dr. Hager weekly to um, discuss about my research and he went over my abstract and my protocols and see everything work out right. We focus in the effect of uh, different salinities on the growth rates of salicornia and um, the photosynthetic rates of the plants. What I always liked about her is no matter what setback she faced, she always would try again, try again, try again. The McNair program um, prepares undergraduate students at UMass Boston who usually wouldn't have access to um, graduate school preparation. So we get to have faculty mentor, we get to um, experience other methods of research and actually are able to conduct our own research and have our own research project. For me, the epitome is if we can get students to become research scientists. If it wasn't for the Magni program, I would, never, I would have never think, me, think of me as a scientist in the future. McNair provided me the platform and also gave me the resources for me to be able to um, encounter my professors in a different level rather than classroom platform. And also, I was able to mingle with other my colleagues in a classical-based research project and also interact with different universities. UMAP Boston has a very good program to support undergraduate students, especially underrepresented minority. I'm very fortunate to have a student like Chisholm through the support of Magnet program to work in my lab. Their availability and their resources make students more of a fit in, in research laboratories because they do provide for um, costs for going to conferences and whatever uh, material you need in your lab. It helped me realize that it, research is what I love to do. The McNair program is a wonderful support community and most of my research experience wouldn't be possible uh, without the McNair. We are trying to find evidence for uh, a type of attention allocation that may happen outside of the currently understood model. So the McNair program helps students get exposed into the life of science, but also like uh, working, working in a uh, research lab, doing research, and also gaining skills that will be difficult to um, gain um, outside just by taking um, regular classes. I'm Rick Kessley. My student is Fatimata Ba, and um, our lab is a genetics lab, and she is working on a genetics project to identify the genes that have changed during the domestication of plants. A kind of like a small community where I've, I can not only get a experience into a research lab, but also uh, attend seminars and travel uh, to, for, to do uh, presentation. Um, I've been out of state doing presentation, which was uh, sponsored by the McNair program. The McNair program is a very um, diverse program, and we have a lot of students in there with different educational level, like some of them are seniors juniors, etc. And we are more like a family than it is uh, of a student organization and I felt like it's a place I belong. Taught me a lot of things such, such as like doing surgery on a rat that I was freaking out the first time I was doing, I was about to freak out the first time I do it and but she did it, she did it like step by step and like she's really patient with me, helped me a lot and she's the best mentor. I knew her from my neurobiology class, um, I think the fall prior, where she was one of the best students. And then so she was really interested in neuroscience and she came and talked to me about working in the lab. Up until a couple of weeks ago, it was not clear that she would have results. And through like enormous hard work and fortitude and having this collaborator student work with us, work with her, um, she actually got some very interesting data. 
McNair has uh, um, challenged me to be a much better speaker and um, much better um, uh, researcher and much better presenter. I've always been interested in um, how spatial uh, resources affect uh, communities. Gene came to me because he was interested in urban agriculture. So basically he wanted to see what uh, opportunities there were in the urban area, Boston, Chelsea, Somerville area for um, producing locally grown healthy food for the uh, populations that live in those communities. A great person, great student. Um, he will be successful in what he chooses to do. He came to us looking uh, for uh, projects related to urban planning, and I, and I have a feeling that he'll, he'll do something like that in his career as well. Um, the McNair program definitely helped me improve some of my weaknesses. Um, it helped me um, have more confidence in myself and to really push me to do things that I might not be comfortable with. But in the end, I can say that I, I was able to do it, even though in the beginning I, I had some doubt. In five years, I'll probably be graduating from a, uh, a PhD program, hopefully in, in cognitive science. My fellow students at the McNair program are like brothers and sisters to me and because they have been uh, supportive in so many different ways and I thank them for always being there. The McNair program is like um, my family. Everyone is really nice and supporting each other. Um, we are helping each other and we success together. For me, the McNair program is family. The McNair program to me is guidance, the opportunity, encouragement, identify undergraduate student with research potential, research opportunity. For me, the McNair program means support and opportunity. Great community of support. The McNair program is wonderful. Opportunity. Uh, the McNair program to me means teamwork. A opportunity. The McNair program is like a second family to me. One of the things I always like to start off programs with, with respect to Ronnie McNair, is a quote that he said. He said, for you to have a dream come true, you first of all have to have a dream. And that's what all you students have now. You have a dream, you've succeeded up to the first plateau, and now the future is ahead of you.